Hi, I'm Mary. Good morning. It's the morning right now for me, so good morning. Um, this is my YouTube channel. I have tried this uh, many times before, and it's never worked out. And by never worked out, I mean I have given up like a little loser. So, here I am today. The ideas have been rolling in my head for the past few months, and I feel like this is my shot. This is my time. I'm ready for it. So today, I made a video about styling hats for spring. Ugh, I sound gross. I wish I hadn't said that, but I that's what the video is about. So this is for people that are a little freaked out by hats but really like them. I used to be really freaked out by like just accessories in general, like really nice scarves back when scarves were really big. Um, like when I was 14, 10 years ago. But I just realized that nobody cares about what you're wearing, especially when you wear it with confidence, like you know what you're doing. So that's what I do now with hats. And that's my encouragement for anybody that wants to wear hats and doesn't know how, you can wear them with literally anything to literally anywhere. So yeah, let's just jump right on in to this video. Sick. So, I made a few different outfits. They're all on the ca more casual side. Not saying that you couldn't wear a hat with something fancy because I've seen people wear hats with wedding dresses recently, which is cool. Not my vibe personally, but that's okay. The first outfit I wore with a little white t-shirt. This is my mom's and it's brand new and she has never worn it. She doesn't know that I wore it in my video. I like it because it's a little different, okay? It's not just your regular plain white t-shirt. It's just a little different. The thing about like plain items like this is I wear them with big jewelry. I'm a big earrings person. You can probably hear mine just rattling around right now and that's, that's okay. That's who they are. Let them be, please. Thank you. Put this with a pair of jeans. Pretty sure it was these ones. I think it was. I flipping love these jeans. And I'm going to tell you why. Because I got them in the little boy section at Walmart. Ooh, it was they were $10. Um I realize that most people can't do that. I am a particularly small person. I'm 5 feet tall. Um and these are 14 regular in boys, faded glory. But what you can do if you're a little bigger is buy like a men's size. I almost fit into them, but just not quite. So that's why I went to little boys. Anyway, they look like mom jeans. People will say, love your mom jeans all the time. It took me a while to figure out the right length to cut them, but I finally cut them to the right length. And um, I love them and they were $10. And they have all different, um, you know, washes and stuff like that. and called balling on a budget my friends so we will make a video about that because you know it's a little process sometimes you need step-by-step -step instructions and that's fine and that's good so yeah that's what I did little white top boy jeans mom jeans whatever and some heels and my hat and good to go sitting over there all alone what the heck I'll just tell you about her really quickly she's from Target okay she's beautiful she's lovely she's made of gold what sometimes I just say things and they just come out of my mouth anyway I really like this hat the brim's got a little bent over the years uh, and by years I mean since I wore her last summer because she's not even a year old I feel like it's a casual hat, but since it's a boater, there's something different about it um, that can go in a few more situations than maybe your standard, like, felt hat would. You know what I'm saying? I mean? No I mean? Gross. Maybe not with this outfit, because this is a little more winter. 
and that's that's okay. <laughs> hey, okay, I'm done. Next up, what I did um, was a little more edgy, a little more zhuzh to it. Okay, stop again, stop, Mary. I um, did this little wrap top, also from Target, just like the hat. Target, don't sleep on Target, please. They're doing things right sometimes. So this little wrap top is a little crappy. My tummy was zhuzhing out a little bit because I gave it, and that's fine. Wear it with the same young boy jeans. It sounds weird when I say that, but I call them my little boy jeans because they're from the little boy section, so they're my boy jeans. Um, with a booty, just a black booty, and the hat. And you might think, hmm, that outfit seems a little more fall spring it's just got like a like a more wintry vibe to it i get that but no just no dress it up the way you want to dress it up and the way i wanted to dress it up was springy so i put the hat on it is what it is and it's cute look at it now <laughs> sneaker vibes I think this is mm, what it's one of my favorite outfits because it just feels very springy to me the top I wear this with I wore the other day it's in the dirty clothes sorry um I envisioned this outfit and I was like where am I gonna get a midi skirt I don't have a midi skirt and I don't want to spend money I went in my mom's closet <laughs> Mom, why are you holding on to things like this? They're ugly, false. They're cute when you style them right. So that's what I did, I think. I think I styled them right. I'm confident in it. I have seen people doing this thing where they tuck their shirt up under their brassiere to make it more cropped and instead of tucking it in. I think that's really cute. You can do either one. I'm a fan of the little slightly cropped little tummy out showing. Again, I gained weight for this, okay this little midi skirt from my mom's closet and I wore it with sneakers and I think it's just a really good look. The hat, the sneakers, the skirt, the little crop. It's just a little fun and flirty spring vibe. Like I'm here to play. I'm just here to play. There's nothing else. I'm here to play. I'm an Enneagram 7. I'm 100% here to play. Also wanted to mention that if you don't have a midi skirt, just wear it with a maxi skirt fun little flirty maxi skirt. I love this maxi skirt so much. I don't show it in the video. Did I shake it and like lint came off? That's not cute. It's also from Target. Crazy. And it's got this little um, slit. So when you take pictures, you kind of like draw it up your leg a little bit and show a little leg and you're cute. Um, I love this skirt so much. It's flipping adorable. Um, pet peeve. There's a ruffle in the front and it doesn't come around to the back. But that's what Target is. They just do stuff cheap like that. with this I wore and it is in the dirty clothes I'm sorry um, I actually wore it the same way I wore it in the video I wore it with jeans and I thought it looked really cute but this time in the video I wear it with shorts these ones are from H&M this might be my favorite look in the video just because it's really simple but it's doing something different I think that's my favorite thing is simple items of clothing with a slight twist it doesn't have to be crazy it doesn't have to be huge um, and I think the twist in this look obviously is the hugely oversized candy striped button down. Um, I love that shirt. I got it from Goodwill. If you're looking for like an oversized button down, look in the large, extra large, whatever women's section or just like, like men's section too as well. I think that shirt might be a men's shirt. 
I love it. I like the half tuck. I think it's just a little different um, with the sneakers and then the hat. And um, I just think the hat rounds out the whole look because otherwise you're having, you know, a pretty standard outfit, but the hat pops it up another level. this video um lastly i want to say shout out to um the three people who are watching me like three subscribers one of them is my sister's boyfriend hi jamie um please don't make fun of me thanks yeah if you watched this video i hope you enjoyed it i hope you got a little something new out of it a little inspiration whatever um i will be doing videos similar to this somewhat different. I want to do like a um, decorating my room because I don't know if you can tell my room is pretty much a, a white box. It's literally, there's nothing on the walls. Nothing on the walls. I don't have shams. The only thing of kind of decoration is that clothing rack behind me and I have like a mirror, full length mirror over here. So I might do that. We'll We'll roll, roll with the punches, cross the bridges as we come to them. And um, yeah, I'm going to try and put up another video next week as well. We'll see what happens. So I'm excited. Here we go. I'm not giving up this time. Bye. <laughs>